All right. Okay, so I just did like 400 plus pictures, maybe more like 500. And I'm hoping that will solve my problem of this thing not wanting to record more than like two or three minutes worth of video. So we'll see. I'm going to try not to go over that too much because I want to be able to check in. Because I don't want to ramble on for a while like I just did uh, when it's not recording. But each time I do it, I guess it clarifies things a little bit and, um, you know, still has the effect, just doesn't, doesn't get recorded. So I'll give you a slight, uh, an abbreviated synopsis of what I just said on the other video. So I want to include the loneliness idea. So am I like a lonely soul in general? No, nah, I wouldn't say that I am, but um, it, it has been a little spooky to... Um, to learn to just sort of chill, especially around my apartment um, since the divorce. So I'll usually go out, I don't make a lot of food at home, maybe it's just the bachelor thing. But um, anyhow, yeah, so, but I do have times of loneliness the other night, um, Saturday night, I went out to Cafe Stritch, had an amazing band that really set up a contrast for me as far as how I was feeling. I was just looking for some kind of human contact, just feeling down. And meanwhile, there was a great band. So I, in jazz, I, I favor the deep reeds and brasses. So I like a baritone sax, I like a trombone, stuff like that. And so what they had was a tribute to Bessie Smith. So they had a vocalist for some of the songs and they had piano, bass, drums, and a trombone, and it was cool. It was really good. And had I been in a better mood, which I think I can now better control, um, I, I would have been digging that a lot more. Now, as it was, I did actually enjoy it. I made a little bit of a video, but didn't really stay inside because I just, I wasn't, I, would, I didn't necessarily, because of what I was wanting to do in my heart, I wanted to sit outside um, where the focus focus of attention wasn't just the music. So I was hoping that there would be some kind of, I don't know, like a little more of a random flow of people going on, which is what I look for when I'm out and about. But it was hard for some reason, particularly Saturday night. But I had a nice dinner. And I woke up the next morning feeling like, well, you know what, I have these prospects Again, my heart is, or my mind is learning to serve my heart better. So my mind said to my heart, well, here's what I can do. I will try to push so the prospects, quote unquote, the people that are out there that I feel like I have a connection with, that I'd like to get to know kind of more personally, I need to put it out there. And so that's what I did. So I went to, let me see, hang on, I'm gonna stop and see if this is still going. Yes, it's still going. Okay, so I cleared out my memory, and I'm good to go, I think, so I can keep going. So, one person, um, Berkeley, um, she works at Whole Foods. We've had some cool interactions, like pretty much, she's like as much of a friend as somebody at a grocery store can be without actually getting to know each other outside that setting in those sort of 30 second conversation so she knows the kids she likes the kids we've had some cool chit chat um, she she decided that I was a likely candidate at, for a ween fan the band